tomorrow. So we back from cooking tonight and I'm gonna make me a mocktail, which is gonna help me with sleeping. So I looked up these herbs. Um, I went and found them all today when I went to the stores, but I'm not gonna make the angelica root or the, um, I'm not gonna make the angelica root or the um, skull cap because I need something to steep this in. So I need like a strainer thing to uh, steep it in. So that's the skull cap and this is the angelica root. And so all of these are supposed to help you. But what I am gonna do is some magnesium lemonade. I got this little stick packet and then golden seal, which is good for your pancreas and then kava which is good for your nervous system. So I am gonna do the, these. Okay, y'all, so we pour some orange juice. It's crazy because I just bought this today and it's already gone, but whatever. Um, this is that Natalie's Tangerine Juice from Sprouts. It's not as sweet as I would think it should be, but when my grandma used to have Tangerine um, tree in front of her house, I just be sweet. But it is what it is. So I poured that, and then we gonna take some um, this is the palmelo. They say you use a citrus fruit to help with the um, vitamin C. So I'm just cutting it into some slices so it can fit in the juicer. And then we're just gonna juice it. Just like that. Oops. now we're gonna do the kava it says to do 30 drops in juice or water i don't know if i'm doing 30 drops now that just kind of sounds like a lot but i ain't gonna lie the girls who i've seen doing it on tiktok or the one girl who said she was down there drunk she did use like three whole dropper fulls but i'll probably just do 15 drops. 30, it just kind of seemed like a lot for my first time. And they say do it one to three times a day. Like, God damn. How stressed out do you people be? All right, so we're going to do. So we got the cover. And the drop was full, so let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. All right, 15 drops of that. Golden seal, this is for your pancreas. Um, oh, it stank a little bit. Oh, shit. It stank real bad. Let's just do a couple drops of this. It say 30 drops too. I just did 10, okay? Cause this thing real bad, like it's nasty. And then we are gonna put the back in there. Alright, 
let's just start one more time. This golden seal stink as fuck. Oh, this golden seal nasty. I can tolerate it without that. Let me put a little stevia in here. Now garbage something. All right, we're gonna put a little agave. Ooh. I don't know y'all It's alright But that's all it is all right. I can't even know another word to describe it Let's have Mama's taste hers. Now, it got a little taste to it now. It got a little taste to it. But I did add something extra in it. This is this herb called Golden Seal, which is good for your pancreas. Because you know your pancreas is like where your body breaking all the sugar and fat and stuff like that. So when you have like high cortisol levels, like if you feel stressed or things like that, your pancreas is usually not breaking the stuff down good. So I did add golden seal in there. And it is made with tangerine juice. But I also put agave in there to sweeten it up. It's not that bad. It's tolerable. It's that golden seal. It's getting worse. Just you just have to sip some. It's getting worse. It's getting stronger. Mamas, that barely even wet your fucking tongue. No, it was a good amount. No, it was not a good amount. You need to drink more. A average That's size how sip. I drink. Not a mama sip. A average sip. <laughs> Regular average sip. There you go. It's not bad. Yeah, it's tolerable, but... It's got just a little aftertaste to it. Reminds it's the me of, seal. like, fish oil pills or something. It reminds me of grass. I've never ate grass. Like, you know how it smells, though? Like, when people cut the grass? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what it tastes like to me. Yeah. But I feel like it's probably going to work. Seems like it's kicking in. I didn't give the full 30 drops of kava. I only gave 15. Yeah, 30 sounds like a lot. Well, it says you can take 30 drops three times a day. Oh, my God. But I said for the first time, we can take 15. in the bottle? I don't know. But I only did 15. And then I put that magnesium lemonade in it. So it might make you go to the restroom. Make you go to the restroom. What just happened? Made a mess. Got it on my clean nightgown that I just washed. I'm good though. Wow, Mama's just finishing hers. I only took two sips of mine. It's not bad. It's not bad at all. Okay, we're going to check in in like 30 minutes and see how we're both feeling. You think I'm going to stay up for 30 minutes? I'm going to take my ass to bed. Okay, you can still let the vlog know how you feel. <laughs> vlog. It's 4.47 a.m. We just got back in. She made this drink. I patiently waited on the couch. Usually, I get in the shower, 
and I hop in bed, but I come down here to wait. Um, I'm sorry, I won't be giving you guys a 30 minute review. <laughs> I will. I'm giving you an immediate review because I'm about to go to bed. So. We'll check in in 30 minutes, y'all. Just don't fucking pay her no attention. All right, it's 4.51, and I just wanted to check in with y'all and let y'all know I'm feeling very chill. It's been four minutes. All right, it's 4.53, and I'm borderline asleep. I just want to go to bed, but apparently I have to wait. 25 more minutes to give y'all a review. I don't think I'm gonna make it. Okay, y'all, I feel pretty good. Um, don't feel that much of a difference. Feel a little calm, but not, you know, nothing too extreme. I'm gonna lay down because I'm off at the top. So I'll let y'all know. It's only been like 20 minutes, but I'll let y'all know how I feel in the morning. Okay, y'all, here goes mama's um, version no, of it. I don't need that. Did you put melatonin in that drink? Did you put melatonin in that drink? <laughs> Did you put melatonin in that drink? I've never had melatonin in my life. And people have told me what it's like to be put on melatonin. Mm hmm question why do your eyes look like that did you put <laughs> did you put melatonin in my drink Shire? do you think i put melatonin in your drink i feel drugged i feel drugged do i look drugged um What the fuck do you think? Yeah, I think you did. <laughs> Where the fuck would I get melatonin from? <laughs> you had melatonin. You was taking melatonin. Okay, well, you should go lay down. I don't got no choice. Do you feel sleepy? How does it make you feel? Drugs. Like, what kind of drugs? Like, melatonin. <laughs> <laughs> you never even took melatonin, so how can you say melatonin? Like. And what have they, they told describe you? Describe this feeling that I feel right now. Describe it to the vlog, please. Drowsy, tired, ready to just pass out. I mean, I've held on. Mm -hmm. I was ready to pass out 10 minutes ago. Mm -hmm. So you feel it is relaxing you and calming you down. I didn't even get to finish all mine. Is it that bad that you regret it? I just feel like you put melatonin in my drink. Why I would I put melatonin? In? I don't fucking have melatonin. Melatonin don't even come in powder. It comes in gummies and pills. Then why do I feel like this? What was in that drink that made me feel like this? It's it called kava and melatonin. the magnesium. It's the same ingredients in melatonin. It's magnesium and kava. And that's in melatonin? I told you, people who are addicted to alcohol, they take kava. It gives you the same feeling as alcohol, but not alcohol. I'm going to bed. I hope you have sweet dreams. Can you cut off the light? Thanks. I hope I do too. Okay, y'all. It's the next day. Mama said she slept good and woke up feeling like she was high. I don't feel high, but I did. I do feel like I slept good uninterrupted. But well, I'm motherfucking tired still. But also my period is on, which is going to make, you know, of course, that'll make you tired. So... I gotta go get us some bread real quick, and I'm probably gonna get me a little sub from Publix. Ooh. Mama's got me trying on some goddamn boots that don't fit, that we tried on yesterday. One thing my mama, she don't like to give up. Let me I tell y'all, let me tell y'all about this thing. <laughs> <laughs> this lady don't like to give up. These boots, let me just show y'all. Look at the boot on my foot. You have to hold. Oh wait, am I recording? See, like this one not even going down. Keep trying, mamas. 
just take them back and get something else for yourself. No. Yes, it's not God. going down. It's not going down at all. Mm -mm, that right one. Where is where it stop at? Like right My here. My foot is right there. Okay, try try this one again. Mama's <laughs> just, just give it. Oh. Try the book. Take them back and get something for yourself. I don't feel like going back to the people. Okay, well I'll go back. Let it go. Y'all, this is just. Okay, y'all, we back from Publix. Y'all, it was a mess. It was like four people working in the whole stove. They was in there screaming. A lady was waiting on her sub for over an hour. The receipts were from the online sub order was so long, it was dragging on the floor. It was one man making sandwiches. He kept taking breaks. He talking about, you the last one. Then here come two people after me. Then the manager was like, you can't close down. You can't close down. Did you let somebody know? It ain't time to close. He was trying to shut it down. Yo, it was such a mess. And the Publix ain't even 90 days old. It was terrible. Then I went to Kroger and got some bread. That was fine. But it's time to go. It was almost time to go. So I'm going to pack up. And yeah. All right, y'all. So it's Sunday night. Well, it was really Monday morning. It's like five in the morning. We just got in from selling food. So that's gonna be the end of this vlog, y'all. This vlog probably all over the place, but that's how my life is to be all all over the place. Um. So yeah, I'm gonna start vlogging again. We're gonna start a new vlog. Y'all should see it after this. So if you are, are um. What I was about to say. Oh, yeah. Let me give you my outro. So, thank y'all for watching. If you haven't already, subscribe to my channel. If you're a returning subscriber, I love you so much. And I appreciate you. And I'll see y'all in the next vlog.